work anything. It's the the level of her sexual, you know, uh, response is based on the extent of her circumcision. my channel my name is nancy amadi and you what's your name welcome to my channel and to my old subscribers thank you guys please remember to subscribe and send in your comments if you have any i appreciate you all today's educative talk is about circumcision the origin of circumcision there was a time when i was in the university i i was going to school from my village and um, a day came when they wanted to circumcise a child and then i asked my grandpa grandpa why do they circumcise um girl children he said because um they don't want them to to be wayward or to start you know going around misbehaving sleeping with every man you know we, we talked to a lengthy you know extent so i got to realize that men actually are the reasons why circumcision came into play at the first time or for any reason in short now men cuss up mm. now they say that because then the women that are not circumcised they are always sexually active remember i told you in my previous video that the clitoris is where the whole sexual life span of a woman is is wrapped there that thing that thing that clitoris is just the 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 in short the the bomb of a woman's sexual life do you get me so he said that because of that so that's why they you know circumcise them now these men were the ones that were complaining their wives are wayward their wives are uh, uh, wanting uh, sexual intercourse or sex too too often they don't get satisfied blah 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 they now brought about circumcision so that when they cut out the clitoris the woman will not have you know the desire to have um, sex every time these were caused by men this circumcision came up by men do you understand now they sat down and talk about it i don't know whoever i don't even know the the, whole, the states that brought the whole thing but then they started executing circumcision now but fast forward today is now disturbing the whole society as a whole men you don't want your wife to be going around you are complaining that the woman is too sexual act, sexually active you put started circumcising the woman now the same woman that is sexually active that you don't like after you finish circumcising her she's in the house you will now go and marry another woman because in the olden days this man used to marry plenty of women oh tell me why you are marrying the woman now you say the other one is not enough for you and uh, you want more so that if you want sex you can have sex anytime you want but the one that was not circumcised is there with you in your house you say you know one time you want the one you want make you circumcise and make you go for another one i don't understand you as in okay in the olden days man i don't understand our our forefathers i don't understand them why they brought this kind of a thing do you understand okay now at the end of the day when you finish circumcising her she can't stay one place you still complain say she she, she need to give you sex as she wants you can't go to marry other women so that when you want the sex you can have it the way you want if this woman is not available this one will be available why you can't circumcise that one where they're available for you ah men men <clears throat> okay the next one now is that our men started complaining abby our generation of his generation men now started complaining that their women are not sexually active they are not this they are not that when it comes to sex now research was made and discovered that it was because of the circumcision circumcision was now abolished now became a crime hmm? in our society or in the whole world now so now the women are now being uncircumcised after childbirth, every woman live your life so you can you can actually you know have the sweetness of sex all the days of your life. The men are beginning to complain again that uh, their women are becoming wayward. Their women are cheating. We cannot have a a, a, a a submissive woman. We cannot have a woman that is not cheating on us. Uh, the, our woman is cheating. Our woman is not cheating. Haba. You even hear some men say, ah, I bet go. This is my wife too. They sexually active. Are they fear making no call? You no call. Uh, uh, begin to follow another man before you know it the man will not want the woman to either walk some of them have heard where the man went the the, the man went 
you know, to a, a, a voodoo person and did charm so that the woman will not be going out. Any, any man that crosses the woman, something will happen to either the man or the woman. Just because you don't want the woman to go out. Now, if you know you don't want the woman to go out, why not make yourself sexually available? As in, is there any way we can actually please this man? You see why I say most men are selfish. Size the woman. You say she's not sexually active. If they did not circumcise the woman, you say she's overactive. What do you want this woman to do? Are we women going to kill, give your, give you men our blood? Now, the, this modern era men, now, that want sex, that always, always, always complain that is because the wife is not there for him sexually. That is why he's going out. Okay, now the women now are no more being circumcised. Stay now is a problem. What is going to happen to this whole sexual world of ours? Please, who even brought out this sexual hyper thing going around the, the whole world? Sex is not the only thing that matters in marriage or in a relationship. Companionship and procreation, first of all. So anybody that is bringing sex, 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 and making it as if it's the major, major thing that holds a relationship or marriage, that person just wants to hit that relationship on a rock. Or that person just doesn't love that woman. Do you understand me? Yes, because we don't know how else to please this man. But the best thing that I like now is, thank God that our women of this era are no more circumcised. Men, deal with it. Now what you have to do is make sure you are sexually available for this your wife. Or else, <laughs> you're on your own, no? You're on your own. You see why I say women are more uh, um, polygamous in nature than, than men. Women are more polygamous in nature than men. All these men will be doing, uh, men is polygamous in nature. You are not polygamous in any nature. Women are more polygamous in nature. I will make another video about that one and educate us about that one. It's because of this circumcision issue. That's why I look at it. Women are not uh, sexually active because their clitoris have been tampered with seriously. Now, some women are circumcised little. They cut the edge of their clitoris. They will still be sexually active. Yes. Do you understand? Now, the women that they cut their own, maybe second degree cut, they will still be sexually active, but they will be like 50% sexually active. Then the women that they cut off their, their clitoris completely, that one, even if you like touch them from morning till night, you know they work anything. It's the, the level of her sexual, you know, uh, response is based on the extent of her circumcision. Some cuts <laughs> complete, some cuts small, some cuts little, some cuts marginal. So you have to find out which one your woman is. If she's circumcised, if she's not circumcised, the level of the circumcision and see and help her on how you guys can enjoy a good sexual life. It's not all about you men. It's not all about, all about you men. Eh? You know, they walk like that. Please look for what works for you. If your woman is circumcised, look for how you can make her to feel sexually attached to you or sexually in the mood. Don't blame her for what she has no power, what she has power, uh, she doesn't have power over. You don't blame her. She did not ask her parents to circumcise her. She did not ask her, 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 her forefathers to introduce circumcision. I mean, she was still a baby as at that time. She don't even know what is happening to her. She only agreed to know that, ah, even some women don't know that they are circumcised. Some women can't even tell the difference between circumcised and uncircumcised woman. So you as a man, you are there to help. Remember, to become one. You have to know how to help her. You have to find out things. Study the body. Look at the body. It's your own. Know what works for this body. Study the body. Find solution. It's not all about you. Please, my guys. Please. So this is how the circumcision came about. It's still you men that demanded for the circumcision. It's still you men that is still complaining about the circumcision. It's still you men that is still complaining about the circumcision. <laughs> so please, hope I've made my point. Hope I've educated us about the circumcision. Hope I tried. Mm, clap for me. So till I come your way again, remember to keep safe i'm sweating so bad there is fun but i'm still sweating remember to keep safe because it's good to keep safe sexually medically 
financially, materially, spiritually, emotionally, and all the lily, 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 the lily.